Hey guys, thanks for tuning into the channel. Don't forget to click subscribe and hit the bell so you get all the updates. All right, this is the uh, free wing ME 262 twin 70 uh, millimeter uh, EDF jet. And uh, I have a love-hate relationship with this airplane. I love the way it flies. Um, it's really good, but I have botched the landing and crashed this thing. Um, there's a video of it. I'll put a link in there. And I had to go in and put some carbon fiber rods in this area here. Um, just to uh, make it structurally um, stronger and then uh, just what two weeks ago Jeff What was I doing? Yeah. I was flying over uh, the trees over here, and I got good and I was right having fun there. And, and uh, put it in a vertical uh, uh, at Attitude and put it in a spin and these things don't spin. They're not made to spin inverted at that at 80 feet and so uh it got stuck in the top of a tree and I'll post pictures of that. And so I fixed it uh, and everything was good. When it got in the top of the tree, it wasn't that bad. I just had to put a new nacelle and everything else was good. So this is the first time I'm gonna actually fly it. And uh, I never did a video, a maiden flight of it. So I'm gonna take it up and fly it today and pray to God that it comes back down uh, in one piece. So there we go. So I'm walking on out. I like this airplane, it flies excellent, but uh, me and this airplane just have some bad mojo, I guess. It sits really low to the ground. It sits very low to the ground. So when you're landing it, you know, you got to pay attention to that, um, but it, it lands itself really. So, um, but it's, and it takes off on its own. When it's ready to take off, it takes off on its own. So uh, without further ado, let's take it off. It's got tons of power. And it's actually fast. Free Wing says this airplane does about 100 miles an hour. And uh, they're not kidding. All right. All right. Take it off from right to left. Here we go. Had some wind get under the wing on that takeoff there. We're trimming it out. Bring the gear up. And uh, it flies good. That's the thing. It just It's a good flying airplane. And if you're a beginner and you want to get into the twin EDF, it's perfect for that. Highly recommend it. And you can see how it's flying. It just handles well. But it is a jet, so in turns, you want to make sure you keep your speed up. And it's a little windy here today, so uh, it's getting knocked around a, a bit, but uh, it's doing a good job. What do you think, Jeff? Looks good. I'm gonna bring it in for a, a low uh, flyby there. That takeoff was scary. The takeoff was scary. <laughs> but it took off, that's all that matters. Cool, check that out. We've got an Osprey Tilt up there. Rotor. Yep. You know, check that out. And like I said, it's a super stable airplane. It flies good. It's uh this is half throttle and you can kind of see it just cruises. It cruises. What's your flight time? Flight times, uh you're gonna get about four minutes of flight on a five thousand milliamp battery pack. Uh, I'm running a 6S 4500 in this, so, uh, you know, you want to be mindful of it because you're running twin EDFs, and so it's going to suck down that battery much quicker. And so I'm good for about one more uh, revolution around the field, and then I'll set up for a landing, and we'll go that route. But it's an awesome flying airplane, guys. Looks good. Yeah, I mean, it's super stable super stable unlike my cameraman chip 
it's all right. So there we go. It's a good little breeze. Well, we got a stout breeze too. It's probably pushing about 10 miles an hour. So that means up there where the airplane's at, it's about 15 miles an hour and it's handling it like a champ. So I'm gonna do one low pass and I'm gonna set up for a landing. All right, here we go. Coming in low, we're gonna full throttle. Nice. So setting up for landing. Gears down. Long rollout. Lowering the speed. And we're going to keep the power up on this one. Coming in. And there we go. Came in a little hot, but uh, you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. It's got plenty of power. It looks good. It sounds good. If you're looking for a cool flying uh, twin EDF and you don't want to pay $600 like for the, um, the A10, the 80 millimeter free wing, this is also a good option. And just listen to it. And there you go. The free wing uh, ME262 twin 70 mm EDF. Love, hate airplane, but we're good.